Hey guys, what's going on? I haven't made a 7 Days to Die video, and I've been playing this game for a long time. So I started thinking, I always build a lot of bases, and they always look somewhat decently good, and I always put an over amount of work in them. And so I started thinking, I'm going to build a new series, I'm not going to build a new series, I'm going to make a new series called Building Bases. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go out into the world and I'm going to find a pre-made, um, like a pre-made house or something. And I'm going to try to turn it into a really big, really nice looking base that will be able to stand up to maybe like the, maybe the first, second, or maybe the third horde or something like that. It's not for strength that I'm going for entirely. It's just the looks of it so what we gotta do is go find a base and what I've already done is I've already picked out one over here and we just gotta get up the road too but <clears throat> I've already made this I haven't made this base this is a pre-made one here I'm pulling up to I haven't touched it yet so this is all let me kill this guy And we just gotta kill the zombies. Okay, I think we're good. And no, we're not. Turn on our headlamp, look around, make sure the guns are low. Alright, we're good. Okay. So this is the base from the outside. I'm going to show you it from like a distance. This right here is all it is is like an old rundown house thing. It has a few trees out in the front yard, cinder blocks laying around. Broken pieces of wood windows, missing the back door, I think. Um, you get the idea. It's complete crap. And the roof is falling apart. So what we're going to do is we're going to go inside... I'll show you guys around in here. Looks basically the same on the inside. Burnt wood. Trash. Go upstairs. Broken windows. There's no nothing up here. There is an old bed. Some tables. It looks like nothing special. And a staircase I keep jumping over. And am I frozen? Wait, can I seriously not jump? What's going on? We're almost there. We did it. Yay. Okay, basically what I was saying is the point is, is it's all complete. Crap, there's nothing in here. What's in here? No need to open doors. Looks like there's a counter in here, a toilet. Three bottles of murky water. It's nothing good. So now we just gotta completely flip this base around and get it into like the top shape that it probably was sort of before the zombie apocalypse happened. So let's get to work. Well, where should we start actually? We'll start in the most obvious place, the couch. Hmm. 
Well, we could probably tear down everything. So what I'm going to do in this video right here is I'm going to go ahead and skip ahead. I'm not like skip ahead. I'm going to go. Yeah, I'm going to skip ahead. I'm going to go skip ahead to the finished version of the base because I have no footage of me building the base. So. Okay, guys, now we finished up building the house that quick. I will give you a tour of the inside or the outside. Let's see. I'm going to give you a tour of the outside, okay? Even though you guys are in the inside already. Okay, we're just going to get out the gun and look around since it's nighttime and this is supposed to be the road right here. Okay, so we went ahead and removed all of the blocks, trees, and just garbage out of the front yard. I went ahead and added some lighting around the inside, or around the outside basically. I put some cement around the door because that's where the zombies always try to beat into the doors. I put some cement blocks along the bottom here. There's a hole right there. Um, I went ahead and put cement blocks all the way around the bottom. And then what I did is I went and fixed up the porch things outside. Went and redid the entire roof. There is no holes in it. Redid the paneling blocks. We are missing one right there. I did not realize that. And we also went ahead, fixed some street lights, put up the... Uh, what do you call these torches yeah we went ahead put up the torches fix the windows just did all the stuff like that okay now when you come inside you come inside and you can see the left here on the kitchen and the right I'm gonna show you this one right here we went ahead and removed all the old raggy furniture that was in here we replaced it with leather put in some lamps a lamp we put in a fireplace right here we put a uh, fire in there instead of just coal and stuff laying around we fixed the fireplace there's a chimney has a garbage can over here it's empty we put in some metal doors instead of them wooden ones that you can see right through also when you come straight in there's a bathroom right here you come in here there's the two sinks and then a fancy toilet we added in the red floors and then in here in the medicine cabinet, you got your first aid kits, band-aids, painkillers, vitamins, antibiotics, and a loaded 44 Magnum. You come over here to the side right here. We got a cooler set in here, a table, chair, candle. And then just a few things. We got a trash can here, a sink. We have some pipe wrenches, basic things, beakers, grills, cooking pots. You got your canned foods. Go into the oven. We have a cooking pot, a grill, and a beaker. Go in here. Some more canned foods. We have a pot setting on the counter. Go into the refrigerator. There's some raw meats, eggs. Up here we have some honey, water, and boiled water. Same goes for the cabinets up here. And you can also see how your window's quite clear. Now we're going to go up to the top level. <clears throat> up here in this level right here, we come up, we have fixed the entire roof right here. There's no holes in it. And we went ahead and removed all the furniture that was right here in this area. I wouldn't even call it furniture. We put in a gun cabinet. We, we make this what we'd call like symmetrical on each side. We have... It's the exact same on each side, is what I'm getting at. Right here in this gun safe right here, we have the pistol, and we have 9mm rounds. We have this quite organized. 44 magnums, bullets right below it. Sawn off shotguns. One slugs, one's normal shotgun shells. We have the SMG, the bullets for that, and so on. And then we have the crossbow, crossbow bolts, flashlights, knives, machete pipe bombs, steel axe, pickaxe, nail guns, and nails. And we have a bow right here, and some arrows and bullets. In the desk, uh, which is empty, um, we have a TV up here on the wall. Nightstand right here, it has some just clothes in it. Have a lamp and like some nicer beds right here. We redid the floors. 
and it's the same on each side and then if you come over here this gun safe is organized the same way now obviously it is day nine in this game I did go through the seven day horde and it held up nicely I didn't really have to put out any spikes but it's completely up to you how you do the space even though probably none of you are going to copy the space but still we have a light up there on the roof I'm just going to go walk around the house again giving you guys another look we have a few mini bikes out here out front we have two setting here and there was another one out here oh right here yeah we have three mini bikes here I could build like a garage or something over here on the side but that's probably another project now in this thing I don't go through and make every base perfect I mean like absolutely perfect what just happened we leveled up good if I miss a few things I'm gonna leave it in here just to make it more I don't know I call it realistic or something to make it more realistic it's like a one-shot thing I build the whole house I wouldn't say build it. I redo the entire building, or possibly build it or something. This one was pre-made. I just adjusted to it. Like right there, we have a busted block and then two cracked ones from where the zombies are trying to get in. I left that in there, and then we have a small missing post. But these are small things that you probably wouldn't really notice just by looking at a base in seven days to die just because like it being upgraded like this would you could more or less overlook it just because it's less noticeable because you're more focused on other things again to show the inside in here small candles Well, that is it for today's video. If you guys did like it, the uh, new series that I'm trying to start, go ahead and leave a like, comment your favorite part about the house, if you want a certain one built, or anything. If you want me to build something certain, do a certain house on the map, try to describe where it is, or even if you got PlayStation 4, PS4, <clears throat> I'll uh, leave my gamer tag in the description, and you guys can message me, and we can go and play on seven days you guys can we can all mess around so you guys can even show me what the house you want me to build with that being said remember to subscribe if you're new to the channel hit the like button